Hi, uh, this is just a quick um, little bit of information about Volkswagen window regulators. They've been using the same way of attaching the window to the regulator for years now, since the Mark IV, right up through the range. Uh, the regulators come in different shapes and sizes, but generally speaking, you've, you've got a, a motor, um, the center there works on a set of cables, and you've got a slider, which goes up and down, and then you've got the window, which is attached to this slider there. Uh, what generally happens is the, the cables get rainwater on them. Uh, they start to rust. You can see where it's rusted. And then uh, the cable, because of the rust, it frays and then, uh, and then snaps. So it's a fairly simple affair. The motor goes onto, onto this bit here. Um, and then that just winds the cable around and then using cable tension it just works the cables up and down there and that's the slider. So as I said there are different ways of doing the same job but they're all held on by the same method and that's what I'm showing you today. There's uh, on, your, on the window you've got a little white plastic peg which has got an outer and an inner section to it. So. If you look through there, you can see there's a, a, a round nylon peg and if you look closely there's an outer part and an inner part. So what you do normally is you knock the inner part out gently and then that releases the outer part. You put a punch through here, you knock that out and that releases your window. But then what a lot of people do is they, they drop it back down into the regulator and then try to put the, the peg back through um, and there's a much easier way of doing it. So what I've done, I've, I've already put the, um, the peg back into the window to make it easier to, to uh, video. So there's the peg, just, you just push it in with a pair of pliers, push the outer in, then push the center in, squeeze it up with a pair of pliers, sit your window down where it needs to go. So that's sat on top of the little spreadable slider there and then you just get your hand on the top of the window and just give it a crack and then you can see that the the pin has pushed this slider apart what it does it just spreads them apart pushes itself down and then locates itself back in that hole much much easier than trying to do it in situ by pushing it through and messing around i've seen people break windows doing that so so this is what it's going into your window sits in there and all it does is just spreads those apart and then your pin slides down and slots back in there so there we are hope that's hope that's been helpful save you a bit of hassle in the future thanks